And this, is, of course, is what we're all about here. Uh, this is just an animation, of course, but this is what um, in September of next year we hope to be um, orbiting Mars, and we fully intend to, and it's, it's been a great um, journey so far, and we've got a long way to go, and, uh, but we're on track. MAVEN IS GOING TO FOCUS ON TRYING TO UNDERSTAND WHAT THE HISTORY OF THE ATMOSPHERE HAS BEEN, HOW THE CLIMATE HAS CHANGED THROUGH TIME, AND HOW THAT'S INFLUENCED THE EVOLUTION OF THE SURFACE AND THE POTENTIAL HABITABILITY, uh, AT LEAST BY MICROBES OF MARS. WE'RE LOOKING AT a, a MODEL SIMULATION OF THE UPPER ATMOSPHERE REPRESENTED BY THE COLORS WITH THE ARROWS SHOWING THE SOLAR WIND. AND YOU CAN SEE THAT AS THE SOLAR WIND SWEEPS BY, it is able to strip off the atmospheric gas. It looks like it's flowing off here, but it's actually stripped away molecule by molecule, atom by atom. Here is a test that was actually done in Denver, but repeated again in, um, in, at the Kennedy Space Center. And it's a solar ray deployment. Um, this is the wings being deployed and, and ready to fly. I mean, this is how it'll look um, just a few minutes after separation from the Atlas vehicle, three weeks from now, we hope. so. It, it'll fly in this configuration all the way to Mars.